Well, I'm in Kwantan, and this is my view. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Kwan Tan. I'm going to be here for six days, and right now we are going for a morning walk along the waterfront, along the river. And I have to say, it is a hot start to the day. So let's get on and explore. Just noticing these on the floor, not too sure what they are. I'm assuming they're coming from the tree that's right next to me. Assuming they're coming from this tree. Not too sure what they are. They got like a nut shell texture, but quite large as you saw. So this is one of the many little piers along the riverfront, not piers, uh, boat docks. Is that what they're called? Yeah, I've not woke up yet, but this is the view. And as you can see in the distance there, there's a viewing tower, which is very new. It's only recently been built, so I understand. Not too sure when it opens. I've been told it's closed. Now, I'm not sure if that's because of COVID or, or what. So there you can see the Quantan sign. Let's take my mask off. There's nobody here, as you can see. So it looks like part of the waterfront has been blocked off. There's kind of these big metal sheets at the end there. Just wanted to get a view of the tower. And that breeze is so nice. Tower here glistening in the sun. It's a beautiful day. Nice little breeze as well. Well, unfortunately, it would seem that part of the river walk is blocked off. This seems to be a regular occurrence. It happened in KT as well. I don't know why that is. I don't know if it's development work or if it's because of COVID. But never mind, we'll walk back towards the road and then hopefully join the riverfront walk a bit further up. We'll see. Just walking through a parkland area at the moment. And you'll see lots of Malaysian flags and that's because on the 31st of August it's Independence Day. And here is another shot of the viewing tower. So yeah, lots of Malaysian flags but also the state flags as well. So yeah, we've got a really nice little park just alongside the riverfront there. But first I need to go and get a drink and then we'll continue on with the exploring. We are back on the river and I think we're going to try and walk as far as we can. I think there's a park right down here that we can walk around, plenty of shade. But this is beautiful. As you can see we've got some food places around here, very quiet though. I guess most people are working. It's not the, probably a little bit too late in the day for for breakfast, it's probably about 11 o'clock at the moment. It reminds me a little bit of the park alongside the river in Brisbane, Australia. Very similar in style and it's just so chilled out. Not many people around, like I said, most people are working, kids are at school. Not too sure why they're blowing all the leaves into the river, but okay. I've got another fishing boat coming in. Apologies for the noise. Just been watching all the fishing boats coming in from my balcony this morning in the hotel. Fascinating just to see them all coming and going. Yeah, a little sculpture here. I think it's something to do with the local hospital which is just over the road. Yeah. Other than the uh, guys cleaning up all the leaves it's pretty quiet so you can see where we've walked from right down the bottom there where near the bridge and then we've got like a pier here which I think is closed yes unfortunately it is closed no river tars which is why the river is so quiet right now but never mind we're gonna keep walking this way uh, right now is the perfect time to be exploring Malaysia because just <laughs> not many people around. No tourists incoming, all the locals are working. I am literally the only person walking along this river right now. As you can see. Well, it's a dead end at the end of this walk, so 
Gonna look on Google Maps and see where we head to next. So I jumped in a grab taxi and we're now at Taman Jalara. Galara. Not too sure how you pronounce it, I'll put it on the screen. We've got this little lake running through here with all these lily pads. Not too sure if you can see it with a GoPro, but at first I thought it was an alligator or something, but it's some kind of lizard or I'm not too sure what you call them. You see them a lot in Thailand. Probably can't see it on the GoPro now. I know that not everybody likes these park, waterfront, exploring videos, but these are the kind of places that I like to come to. You know, it's a great opportunity to reflect and think and just take in the fresh air and just hear the nature. So down here they've got a little area where you can take off your feet barefoot I guess and or maybe you've got to wear trainers but you can walk across the stones and apparently it's good for your feet so you understand. Always keep hydrated. And typical Darren, it's just in the middle of nowhere. I can see the big new complex right above. And down here, just behind these trees, is the South China Sea. And where we've come from is right over there. And today, we're searching for the rare, rare Malaysian crocodile. Nice little spot. Got sweat coming off my face. Whew. It's a hot one, guys. It's a hot one. It's <sighs> breathing that sea air. <sighs> As you walk around, you also see lots of kind of exercise equipment, which is good. We've got locals exercising as well. See what I mean? All of the outdoor equipment so you can do your exercise and this river, pond, whatever it is, just runs all the way down here. Here is a 180 degree view of where I'm stood right now. So you've got this beautiful little lake here. This is the route that I've been walking around. And then another beautiful lake here. Unfortunately, this has been closed off, this little bridge, because of COVID. But there's nobody here. It's social distancing at its best. And it looks like this lake literally goes all the way to the top here. So I'm going to continue on with this walk. By the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, please do, left the link in the description. And the reason why you need to do is because you're gonna see kind of behind the scenes of this walk. When I go somewhere, I do a video, set of stories on Instagram. I also do photos as well, of course. I am hot and sweaty. So I'm going to end today's video here. I hope you enjoyed it. I will be back very soon with a new video. I'm going to go and get some iced coffee, I think, <laughs> and cool down. So I'll see you all very soon. Take care. Look at turtle.